it's kind of just a way to get the students attention really um, kind of just a flashy demo for class but uh, basically what happens is we have a high voltage power supply that supplies six kilovolts and we charge this huge capacitor with it and um, then we flip another switch which allows the capacitor to discharge across a very thin wire and the resistance is very low so it discharges very quickly and results in the wire exploding basically a lot of times the wire will just heat up you know if we get current through it but in this case it's just too much and it just explodes. One of the things we start out during the spring semester discussing is uh, static electricity and separating positive and negative charge from neutral objects by rubbing things. Then we talk about, well, a power supply can do that pretty efficiently and create more of a charge separation. So for this demonstration, um, we create a lot of charge separation, which corresponds to a fair amount of stored energy, electrical energy. Then we release it. Two, three. A lot of times, uh, you know, we hear about people getting electrocuted and things, but a lot of stuff we do in the lab is very safe. And um, this kind of gives them an, an idea of th that there is a dangerous side. And, you know, it's fun and flashy and there's like a boom and lights and everything, but we also handle this with a lot of care. Physics is just not, uh, you know, we use mathematics to uh, predict things, predict results. That usually involves numbers, so the mathematics. Sometimes students get a little dulled out by looking at formulas, you know. Uh, so this put some real life into the expressions, I think.